Hi guys, it's Ronke here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to make the most expensive gari ever made in the history of gari making. And that is cassava from Canada. First of all, this cassava was almost $7 that you see in this video. So there you go. We have to make gari from scratch. Highly do not recommend it, but it's good to know how to make this thing. So you want to peel your cassava. Uh, you want to chop it into smaller pieces for your blender to be able to handle. Give it a good wash because you don't want any dirt or debris in there. And then you want to blend it like so. I'm using a really, really good quality blender, uh, which can handle this kind of blending. Once you have it blended, you want to pour it into a sack. So this sack, I actually imported it for the purpose of this. Now, I'm going to rest it. Kasa gari is fermented, right? The more tart you want it to be, the longer you ferment it for. So my first fermentation is usually about four days. And then, you know, I take out all of the water like so after like day four this one I actually fermented for seven days because i wanted it to be really tart and then you know you just want to pass the gari through something the gari should be really really dry guys before you want to squeeze out all of the water before you attempt to fry it otherwise it's just going to cake on so once it's dry use a dry pan and just fry it if you want it to be yellow you add palm oil and that is how you make gari from scratch 